Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? <laughs> it's, that, was a, that was a nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh. Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked the out of me. Put my name out your mouth. Wow, dude. Yes. It was a G.I. Jane joke. Keep my wife's name out your mouth. I'm going to, okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just, I've seen this clip before, and I guess we'll talk about it. So, I think it's staged. I don't know what your guys' opinions are, but... You all know Hollywood is controlled by the media and the deep state, so I don't know why I hear different people siding with Chris or Will or whatever. I don't side with either of them because if you do your research, you know that Chris Rock flew on the plane to Epstein Island. You know that they're both players in the media, deep state, and Project Mockingbird and trying to control the narrative. They Everyone in Hollywood has a collective agenda, and that's to tell you what you should think and to push a narrative okay and if you look at the oscars viewership from last year it was an all-time low you know this is just my opinion but you know maybe they realize that people are shutting off their tvs and aren't buying this crap so they needed something for them to turn it back on and this happened so i think we should probably come up with something that should be covered something that you know won't give these people attraction because this is just this is just dumb. It was totally set up. And I know John Schneider made a video about it, which, John, I think what you're doing is great with uh, your own independent filmmaking, but I I I'd even love to work with you on a film one day, but I don't think chivalry has anything to do with this because Will was laughing at the joke, okay? And it just looks totally set up to me. That's just me.